The Minister of Youth and Culture has told the plenary session of the Chamber of Deputies in Parliament that the challenges affecting different development programs meant for the benefit of young people include the failures of some beneficiaries that in turn have led to some of, you, some of the youth cooperatives being unable to accomplish their goals. Prince Manzi begins this edition with these details. Some of the youth in the Kigali city say that being in cooperatives helped them to get jobs and address their daily challenges. When you wake up having a place to go for getting money that addresses different problems you face daily like rent, food, it's a great thing. On the other hand, some of the youth say that not being in the cooperatives in one way or another affected their development and say that local administration plays a role in this. Cooperatives are not there. They are teams. Some of the youth that get money, they definitely join teams of all the people. Because I know none for me to join, I think the problem is the readers as they do not emphasize and raise awareness. The issue of youth cooperatives was tackled on by the plenarization of the deputies' chamber as the Minister of Youth and Culture, Rosemary Mbabazi, gave oral explanations on issues found in the implementation of different youth development programs. The PTs in the Rwanda Parliament demonstrated that youth cooperatives are few and poor. You find that on the ministerial level, it is a good plan, but it does not reach the youth down there. And I ask myself how in accordance to the number, you cannot find even a single cooperative. Like I once found a cooperative that has seeds bid and it is small, and yet the youth have to be in big cooperatives and earn highly. There should be strong measurements for those youth to move from the teams to cooperative because when they stay in the teams, the challenges include not being able to be supported because most of the time you find investors help legally approved cooperatives and that is why you find like one legally approved cooperative in a sector and it is always visited and supported because it is the only one approved. Minister Rosemary Babazi told the deputies that the comportments of some of the youth played a big role in disrupting the development of these cooperatives. The ministry has no problem with emphasizing the youth to join cooperatives because we have established ways to help in this. But this is where the challenges are found. The first are the challenges still found in the management of some of the cooperatives and it discourages most of these youth. Another challenge is mobility in the youth and you find that those that established a cooperative in this region, they change to another area and it affects its durability. The youth is the transition, not a career. We want those who were 25 and started cooperatives. After five years, they have to shift and leave for others to work. This official requested all levels in charge to help the youth in working efficiently, including helping them to have documentations early. The Minister of Youth and Culture also provided explanations on people who graduate from rehabilitation centers and are not supported in creating their own jobs. She reiterated that the government will continue to collaborate with families of these people in making it easier to access materials that help in practicing what they learned. The plenary session was satisfied with the explanations provided by the Minister of Youth and Culture. Prince Manzi, RTV News.